Hey guys. It's been a minute since I posted that video about not making videos anymore. But I wanna make a video again, cause mentally, I'm doing a lot better this year. It's a combination of therapy, antidepressants, reducing stress at work, and most importantly, focusing on setting up Herc. It's done wonders for me, especially my lab. Now, they say travel heals the soul, so I'm off to see some family in the UK, and since I'm there, I decided to visit Gravity Industries as well to give Flying Like Iron Man another shot. And since I'm going solo travel with no cameraman, this video is sponsored by Insta360 and their new X3 camera that shoots in 5.7K with a half inch sensor. The X3 is the future of action cameras. It's the easiest way to capture everything and reframe later for the perfect shot. It has flow state stabilization with horizon lock for buttery smooth gimbal-like footage to impossible third-person views with the invisible selfie stick, not to mention handy AI tools to speed up editing. I've actually been using Insta360 gear for a few years now and it's by far my favorite go-to for camera gear. And if you use my link below, you'll get a free invisible selfie stick. But enough talking, I've got a plane to catch. Coming attendance, I'm doors for departure. Now, the only issue is I'm going to Yorkshire, which has some tiny freaking roads, and this is an SUV. So we might have some fun. <sighs> All right, we got the Insta X3 set up in the car, mounted off of the, uh, the sun visor. I love it. Oh, I almost forgot. I got my new Smith shades from Hacks of That Store. We've got UV and polarized lenses. Plus, they're scratch resistant. Plus now I can pull the Casey Neistat and not even look at the lens. And you guys think I'm looking right at you. I'm looking over there. After fighting off some jet lag and meeting the neighborhood cats, I got to explore my dad's old village as he reminisced of days gone past from seeing his old house. It was this house, number 52. That's the one on the left right here? Yeah, the one with the pit. That was my dad's garden. Wow. To catching up with his sister. I don't make it over here as often as I should, but when I do, I enjoy every second. You think you could drive up to Burnley? When? Tomorrow night. This time around, he took me to the graveyard and we searched for the Hobson lineage. Hobbs. Edith Hobbs? Yeah. You should be up there. There. Okay, bye. At long last, we found one. So this is the grave of my great grandfather, Tom Hobson, who was the son of Red Jim, who was actually the first James Hobson, which makes me the second James Hobson of my family lineage, so. The Hobsons. From there, we went for a hike up the countryside. So this is West Nab. It's the highest point in the Home Firth Valley and we always come for a hike here. Ah. It's an easy but tiring hike, but the view is totally worth it. After I said my goodbyes, I headed off to Durham to visit my friends at JJ Industries, who took me on a castle tour. We don't have many castles back in Canada. After that, they took me to Asgard, also known as the Durham Cathedral. It's where they shot part of Endgame. I brought my hammer, so we took a few photos. Next stop, UK's favorite maker. All right, I'm off to Collins. I'm gonna try his new anti-gravity uh, parkour machine. Should be pretty fun and a whole bunch of makers from Maker Central are coming over, including Frankly Built, Emily the Engineer, Xyla Foxland, so it's gonna be great to see everyone. Using the Insta360 X3, I can shoot magical third-person videos with the invisible selfie stick. It's like having a drone follow you everywhere. You can't do that with a regular action camera. We got to try out his latest project, which was so much fun. 
And of course, I volunteered as the first guinea pig. You can do this bit yourself. In fact, if you do like a handstand thing like you did on the floor. Does it, does it feel like it's going to come out? I'll go a bit tighter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that, well, that's that's really weird. Well, all right, I'm up. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Try this beside you. Uh, <laughs> stuck. After a bit more practice, I had a good idea. Bullet time. Alright, here we go. Then, I decided to mess around with one of the newest features on the X3. It's called Me Mode, and it's pretty awesome. Alright. Oh, I can't. I forgot I can't actually face sideways. It automatically frames you in the middle of the shot and erases the selfie stick. It's magical. <laughs> now, you can see the selfie stick in my hand a little bit, but that's because I had an external tripod attached to the bottom. That's my bad. But after Frank goofed around a bit in his Iron Man costume, <laughs> super serious time. He won up me with the best use of me mode. Check this shot out. It's incredible. Oh yeah, that, that looks really cool. cool. Really good. As cool as possible. Three, two, one, go. Okay. Yeah. I can fly. Oh my God. Are you okay? Yeah, I think that's probably the coolest use of me mode ever. That's a good save. <laughs> Boom! Front! <laughs> Despite all the close calls, no one got hurt, which meant it was time for me to try another project the Weeble Wobble. <laughs> Psych, you can't visit Colin Furs and not check out his tunnel. Say later, I may never return. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
like it is wider, right? I like it. I'm so happy we wanted the same thing. <laughs> So it, it, it's day three. We're still stuck in the tunnel. <laughs> Tensions, oh, oh, right. Right. Oh, right. Tensions are running high. We're trying to figure out who to eat next. All right, have fun down there, man. You just, you know, hang out. See ya, Iron Man. From there, it was time to drive to the other side of the country to fly a jet suit. All right, guys, today's the day. It's the day I get my wings. I'm about to learn how to fly a jet suit, and I'm going to film the entire thing using the Insta360 X3 because I want to focus on training, not focus on getting the best shot. With the X3, I can reframe my shots later and make an amazing video. All right, I'm at Goodwood Motor Racing Circuit. It's time to fly a jet suit. So it's about four years since I last tried the jet suit. What's gravity been up to in the past four years? Uh, I'd say, I mean, the technology has come on leaps and bounds. Yeah, uh, the new suit's incredible. Yeah, it's a lot more power. It's a lot more comfortable. Uh, it kind of flies for longer as well. It's kind of better all around, really. Yeah. And I'd say that has been part of the driving force behind doing all these events. We've done 250 now events and exercises in 40 countries. That's crazy. Really mad. How does it feel flying that compared to last time? Light years different, yeah. um, especially like the training rig, the trust system you have yeah. now and the, and the regimented training, it's felt so much more like attainable. Okay. I've only gone four times now and I pretty much hovered on that last try. Yes, there, there is that moment like when a kid is learning to ride a bike and you, you know, mommy or daddy lets go of the saddle and you realize they've let go and everything's still okay. And then you never look back. In fact, using Insta360 Studio, you can actually use AI to auto track and frame your video. It's awesome. It saved me so much time getting the perfect shot. It's been fascinating just learning the, like, getting the feel of just flaring out. That is all your up and down. Yeah, like, there's yeah. no, I, I feel like most people when they see this, they assume there's a gas trigger. The, the reason fact that, yeah, got that precision is precisely because you're not waiting on a throttle. You can exactly. resolve that vertical component like within a second by moving your arms. I got some awesome thermal footage showing that cone of thrust. Yeah. And I'm wondering if mentally, if you could actually just see that thrust. Yeah, if you had some sort of, if you did it in a darkened environment and then some lit light. up. Yeah. Sort of a big laser beam kind of thing. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how you do that. You have to have a ring of lasers around each nozzle. That and could sort of, work. It looked very cool yeah. until you lose it and blind everybody. But uh, <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah, uh, that is an interesting thought actually. This is deliberately designed to be as as controlled and as safe and as progressive as you can imagine. It yeah. really is a lovely way to learn. I'm already like I'm still on the bungee, but it's not it's not pulling yeah. me anymore. So no, until afterwards, yeah, I'm yeah. just like, oh, there's actually nothing holding you. Like. It's, it's there for safety. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But, so so if, you, if you trip over or fall over, that, that line has got you. But yes, you are really doing it all yourself. Yeah, actually, uh, two years ago now, I got to try Jetpack Aviation's yeah. Jetpack. And the difference with Jetpacks and basically any other personal flying device is their vehicles. Yeah. Whereas your suit, you are the vehicle. Yeah. And it's just, once you get it, it's so much more intuitive. Like, it's an extension of your body. Completely. It's like, go. But now you've got complete freedom, which is pretty awesome.
Awesome. Second of a weightlessness, I'm just like, there it is. I'm taking a while to come back down. Ooh, you got new ones. One of these. I got the original. Experience. Perfect. Yeah, so, that's for your experience, just having to go. Awesome. However, you definitely have. I think he's had one of those. Not this yeah, one. Yeah, I've, I've the got original the original, the, the grey one. The grey one. Oh, but the one Tom Cruise has. Yeah, yeah. there we go. Cruise. But you've earned yourself a new one. Awesome, thank you. This one. Ooh. First, your first hover unassisted. Woo! There we go, so really well done. So there's awesome. one more after that, which is your gold coin, which is your first free flight as well. So, in the works. Okay, awesome. but that's, that's a good one to get. So, really well done. So you've Thank got you. three out of the four now, which is pretty good going. Woo! <laughs> pretty good going, you have to come back for some, some more. So, what's, what's next for the company? Like, I uh, hear Racing League. Our broad strategy has been to, yes, do these events, but actually that money goes into then making the equipment ever better yep. which means the medic and military world the professional world are increasingly engaged in what we do and yes we have not lost the passion for the race series guys and girls racing these suits around pylons over water is just still i mean genuinely it's the most fun thing i've ever done and you guys are opening up a, a training facility in california yes just outside of uh, la yeah so you can come and learn to fly uh, and this one's just outside of london and we're gradually opening up more of them. So yeah, That's anybody can come and have a go, pretty much. There'll be links in the description below. Yeah, this cool. has been amazing. Thanks for the opportunity. No worries, pleasure having you back. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video as much as I did making it. Huge thank you to Insta360 for sponsoring this video. And as a special gift to you guys, if you use my link in the description below, you'll get a free invisible selfie stick with the purchase of an Insta360 X3. It's quite literally my new favorite camera and is the future of action cameras. Single lens cameras are so last decade. I know you'll love it. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and let me know what you thought about this video in the comments below. Would you guys like to see more vlog style videos? They're a lot of fun.